Ah, Gaster. I assume this is our weapon. <laughs> he looks quite small. There may have been a few problems, your highness. What type of problems might you be referring to? Nothing of dire consequence, I hope. Well, your, your majesty, I regret to inform you. He has no observable powers. Perhaps some will develop as he grows. It is most likely a product of the damage done to my lab. His soul was altered. He now has a mere one HP and zero attack. On the bright side, he shows signs of incredible intellect. This is no excuse, however, for I have failed your wishes and beg forgiveness. One HP? Zero attack? This is an outrage! Unacceptable! You had one mega task and you failed! You will regret this mistake! And the day you ever crossed us! Let us erase this failure. Oh. No! <clears throat> I, are you alright? Perfectly fine. Nothing a quick heal won't solve. These are the days I wish nothing more than to have my work complete, so I can leave this dreadful AU. My queen, calm down. We must not be rash. Very well. We shall settle our scores in a civilized manner. With chance. Should chance favor you and you roll six, you shall be permitted to live. One out of six chance. Fair enough. I don't know. Well... <laughs> Looky what we got here. This'll pay a fortune. <laughs> Someone has saved Tim? Are you alright? Hey, Tim. Most believe you to be only a myth. A myth Tim is not, but very grateful Tim is. Before I win, take us this. One of our legendary bracelets, a gift for thee. Don't snob at anyone of this encounter. We prefer to remain a myth. Wow. Thank you. I'll be sure to keep your secret. My bracelet is enchanted with incredible chance, crafted by the elusive Thames. It provides me with a 12 out of 13 chance of success. Congrats, Gaster. You live to see another day. However, we must kill the boy. No. He's causing no harm. He is a disgrace, a symbol of weakness. I'll keep him for myself. For research. No. I'll strike you a deal you can't refuse. You have no right to bargain with me. I've been pondering the idea for months. A power generator in Hotlands. Fully controlled by you. I can show you the rough blueprints. I'd need at least ten years. You have eight years. If it protects my boy, very well. Let us return home, my dear boy. You must meet your brother. I'm sure he'll warm up to you in no time. If I ever see that miserable mistake again, I will spare no mercy. You look laughable. At least show me you were worth my father's time. Show me these incredible powers that far exceed my own. I know you must have some power. Father wouldn't think you're superior to me otherwise, and you would be killed. Come on, show me. Are you deaf? Mocking me? I know you can understand English. Fine. Allow me to show you. Please, get along out there, my dear boys. Dinner is almost ready. <sighs> Pathetic. Can't even take a tiny scratch. What on earth? What in Deer's name were you thinking, Papyrus? 
I'm far too tired for this. Uh, I, I'm sorry! I didn't know it would hurt him. I understand. It was merely a mistake. But if you care for me, then please be kind to him. I, I, I will! I promise! Dinner is ready in the kitchen. Now I must depart for work. I do not know when I'll return. Just please do this for me. <laughs> Dear brother, I am so terribly sorry. I have something very special to show you. You have to watch closely. Huh? Beautiful, isn't it? Uh, uh, That's it, brother. Now go to the kitchen and fetch us that dinner. Why, thank you for your help. I'm insane. Surely, surely no sane monster would do this to themselves. Or maybe I'm simply foolish. Sacrificing my life for my family. Yet, sacrificing my family for their lives. I have no team, barely any resources, and my personal work. It appears we'll have to reconvene. It's not beautiful. Beautiful, isn't it? It's so very beautiful. You won't control me any longer. Is that so? Yes! Well, dear brother, I must say I'm quite impressed. Who knew you had the guts to stand up to me? Though, I must ask, what inspired this insurgence? You treat me like I'm nothing. And nothing you are. The second Dad leaves... <laughs> Do you wish to tell him? I will. If that's the case, I shall tell him for you. Really? Of course, Father deserves to know. But... <laughs> know how you've been growing increasingly vexing. How it's been eight years and you're still a powerless failure. How you disobey the simplest request. So listen here. And listen closely. Beautiful, isn't it? You will walk to the core and stop for nothing and no one. When you reach the edge, take but one step forward. Uh, be gone with you, dear brother. I've put up with your insolence long enough. To the core, to the core, you want to the core, to the core, you want to the core, to the stop, no, stop, no, 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 Goodness. <laughs> you. Father, you found him. He must have wandered out from behind my back. <laughs> 